Hello everyone, welcome to That's Expensive. The most expensive wines in the world with prices that continue to rise over time. What exactly is it? Today we are counting down top seven most expensive bottles of wine. So let's go. Before we get started, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. Number seven, Chateau Margaux, 1787, $225,000. This ancient wine, which bore the initials of none other than Thomas Jefferson, had a tragic end. Jefferson was a well-known Ionophile, and while serving as ambassador to France, he frequently purchased bottles from Bordeaux and Burgundy. This particular bottle was owned by William Sollekin, who paid $225,000 for it and celebrated by taking it to a Four Seasons hotel for a dinner. And a waiter accidentally bumped into the table, shattering the bottle to smithereens. While the insurance company compensated him, Sullican will probably never be able to recover from the loss of a wine that he was unable to taste even slightly. Number 6. Chateau Lafitte, 1869, $230,000. When it went up for auction in Hong Kong, the auctioneers expected it to fetch only $8,000. Imagine their surprise when an anonymous buyer from Asia placed the highest bid of $230,000 for each of the three bottles. What the auctioneers didn't realize was that the Chateau Lafitte is regarded as an extremely rare and luxurious item in Asia. Number 5. Shipwreck 1907 Heidseek $275,000 It appears to be an almost impossible price for a wine that people were unsure was even drinkable. However, when the wine was originally intended only for Russia's last Tsar Nicholas II, each bottle cost $275,000 US dollars. The wine was thought to be lost when the ship carrying it sank in 1916, until the wreckage was discovered in 1997. While 2,000 bottles of this wine were discovered, the history behind the bottles is what makes them so expensive. The ship was torpedoed by a German submarine during World War I. This wine had been kept at freezing temperatures for 80 years, undisturbed and away from any source of light. On the nose, Chris Hole reported gunflint, black rifle powder, and something salty, and on the palate, graham cracker, flamed oranges, and burnt lemon oil, among other things. Number 4. 1947 Cheval Blanc $304,375 The 1947 Chateau Cheval Blanc, which was sold in an auction at Christie's to an anonymous buyer for $304,375, is widely regarded as the best Bordeaux ever made. Chateau Cheval Blanc is one of the world's most prestigious winemakers, having received the ultra-exclusive Premier Grand Cru Classe A rank in the classification of saint Emilion wine in 2012. Nonetheless, it has a very amusing incident to back up its excellent reputation. Because of the bad weather that year, it had to be produced under very primitive conditions with many technical flaws, giving it a taste that could never be replicated. Number 3. Jeroboam of Chateau Mouton Rothschild, 1945, $310,700. This is a product of the world's wealthiest family, so the price is not surprising. These wines are produced in the vineyards of Nathaniel Rothschild, who produced the estate in 1853 and are among the most valuable in the world. The V in the 1945 label represents the Allied victory in World War II and this vintage is regarded as one of the best of the last century. While a standard 750 milliliter bottle costs $310,700, a glass of this will set you back around $8,631. On the nose, it has mint, dry green moss, vanilla, and dry pine needles, and on the palate, it has dry soil, raspberry, and sweet dried cherries. Number 2. Screaming Eagle Cabernet Sauvignon, 1992. $500,000. Americans are known for getting the best deals. The most expensive bottle of wine ever sold was made not in Italy or France, but in America, specifically Oakville, California. The wine has achieved cult status due to its rarity and small quantity of wine produced from here. In 2000, a bottle of Screaming Eagle Cabernet Sauvignon 1992, described as spectacular, fetched the unbelievable price of $500,000 at a charity auction. This wine is aged in 60% new oak and is opaque purple in color. It is unfiltered and unrefined at the time of bottling. It smells like jammy black currants and has subtle hints of oak in it. 
Number one, 1945 Domaine de la Romaine Conti, Romani Conti Grand Cru, $558,000. An Asian collector paid $558,000 for the 1945 Domaine de la Romani Conti, Romani Conti Grand Cru at Sotheby's in New York in 2018. Jaws dropped and eyes popped. However, the world record for the highest price paid for a 750 milliliter bottle of Burgundy was broken. Not only that, but it also became the world's most expensive bottle of wine. It is, after all, a vintage unicorn wine from a legendary vineyard. The seven legendary red and white wines from the 4.5 acre Romani Conti vineyard are the pinnacle of Burgundy quality. In addition, the year was scorching. As a result, the wines were extremely concentrated. Then there was the hail and frost, which reduced production. There were only 600 bottles made. The majority of them are no longer alive. Long, complex aromas, layers of earth and spice flavors that deserve to be savored in every drop, and a silky texture packed in the bottle make it worth more than $500,000. In all likelihood, the next time you drink wine, you will be dissatisfied knowing that it is unlikely to be among the best by far unless you have a lot of money. Cheers to our unwavering passion for wine. So guys, that was it for this video. What do you think about our video? Tell us in the comments below. As always, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.